Hey guys, prepared wander out in the woods today. Uh, it's uh, squirrel season in Ohio, and I'm on a little bit of an impromptu hunt today. And uh, I've got my Ruger 1022 out with the uh, Magpul backpacker stock and I'm just entering the woods right now so I'm trying to be quiet all right I need to get my gear ready so stay tuned we're gonna do a little hunting today seen much out here today it's uh it's pretty quiet i was out here yesterday and there was um there's some guys already moving through these woods shooting like crazy and of course i found their trash and their shells shells that they left behind they're shooting 410s um it just surprises me when sportsmen come out to places like this and they can't clean up after themselves it's just it's so so dang annoying I don't have any stuff to pick up trash with me today I don't have any bags so I'll have to come back out here another day um, and pick up the rest of the stuff but this is my usual spot that I like to come out and hang out at and during the weekdays there's nobody out here <clears throat> so I got the woods to myself but the squirrels are I haven't even seen any definitely some trees up here that I've seen squirrels in um, some good good nesting spots and uh, some spots where I've seen a lot of uh, litter on the ground from where they've been feeding on nuts and stuff but I don't see anything today it's super quiet so what I've got going today is um, I brought the uh, Ruger 1022 this is the breakdown model. What I've done is I've uh, updated it with this Magpul backpacker stock and this Bushnell scope. I did a review on this uh, a while back ago, but this is the first time I've had it out in the woods hunting. And uh, if I don't see anything here in a minute, I'm probably going to do a little shooting just for the heck of it, because I want to uh, make sure I'm still zeroed in and everything's operating the way it should. Um, Can you see the target over there? Right there. Alright, so here's my uh, target shooting across from over there. I'm glad I sighted it in because uh, shooting at first, a little low and over to the left. So I adjusted, and actually, this is the first shot I did, which was almost dead center, just a little low. And then I, I put it off to the right a little bit. So then I, I dialed it up just a bit and back over and then now I'm hitting here. So not bad. Definitely need a little more adjustment, but um, for a red dot sight that's non, you know, doesn't have any magnification, it's not bad, but it could certainly be better. 
and uh, I was shooting offhand, standing, no bench rest, nothing like that. And I'm thinking it's probably oh, 30 or 40 yards. That can't be right. I'm not sure what that distance is. It's got to be under 30 yards. Probably around 30. So anyway, that's that's kind of where I'm at with it right now. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I know there wasn't a whole lot going on today, but I wanted to get out here and just play around the woods a little bit. And I'm glad I took the opportunity to sight the rifle a little bit more and see how it was doing. Um, definitely really digging the backpacker stock from Magpul. Uh, some, a big improvement over the, the standard Ruger takedown stock. Um, it's lightweight, uh, has good ergonomics. I think the only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add the uh, the riser on this and push my, my cheek weld up just a little bit because I, I felt like uh, it was a little low. So I think that could be better. But um, overall, the ergonomics are great. Um, of course, the rifle shoots really nice and uh, such a great rifle plinking and hunting and, and backpacking or whatever you got a really nice gun that you can take with you um, <clears throat> all right guys thanks for watching as always please like subscribe and share and we will see you next time on the prepared one